this. You'll disturb them. Yeah, I certainly will. Wake up, Hugh. Young lady, you don't realize who this is. I don't care who he is. Your car nearly knocked me over, and you're sleeping? Well, of course. It's daytime. Well, I'll see you soon, Averick. I'm sure I won't last longer at this school than at any of the others. Maybe the driver saw green and thought it meant go. Miss Galindo! Miss Galindo! Oh. <laughs> Miss Galindo? I know I'm just a mere munchkin. <laughs> but even a munchkin has feelings. And I've tried to tell you of mine for you. But sometimes it's like you don't even know who I am. That's not true, Big. Bob. Big. Do you realize who that is? You're touching me. <gasps> That's the arrow Tickler. He's that winky prince whose reputation is so scandalous. <laughs> Were you looking for something or someone? Oh, yes. Some sort of history class. Somewhere. Well, the history building's there. But if you want... class just ended. Oh, perfect timing. So, what does one do for fun around here? Nothing. Until now. Ah. Uh, we've been studying. <laughs> well, I see that once again the responsibility to corrupt my fellow students falls to me. The trouble with schools is they always try to teach the wrong lesson. Believe me, I've been kicked out of enough of them to know. They want you to become less callow, less shallow. I say to I invite to rest in, stop studying strife, and to learn to live the unexamined life. Dancing through life, skimming the surface, gliding where turf is smooth. Life's more painless. For the brainless, why think too hard when it's so soothing? Dancing through life, no need to tough it when you can slough it off as I do. Nothing matters, but knowing nothing matters, it's just life. When you're thoughtless, those who don't try never look foolish. Dancing through life, mindless and careless, make sure you're wearless. Trouble is right, woes are fleeting, blows are a blessing. When you're dancing.
can invite her. Oh, Vic, really? You would do that for me? I would do anything for you, Miss Galinda. <laughs> Excuse me, Miss Nessa Rose, there's something I'd like to ask you. You're good. I don't know what you mean. But I do happen to be free tonight, so... So I'll be picking you up around eight. After all, now that we've met one another... 